So I bought my cat Simba a cat it um, water fountain and at first I was really really worried because he was too scared to get close to it and he just wouldn't get close to it and we've tried everything by kind of like introducing him to it or pretending that we were drinking from it and um, today's the second day that I've tried the whole giving him a treat so I had this whisker treats called temptations and he loves them so what I did I basically started putting one treat closer to the water fountain and then closer and closer and closer and then ended up on top of the water, water fountain so just on the edges and eventually on the second day I basically did it again and he started drinking I'm so happy and he's still drinking <laughs> I did the treat trick his lips touch the water. He's going for it. Well done. Good boy, Simba. Good boy. Okay, now I'm going to try to do the same thing with the flower part that it came with and see if Simba will actually drink from the water fountain again. As you can see here, I've actually See how it goes. Yay! He took the tree. He's not scared anymore of the water fountain. Let's see if he drinks. He did it earlier. I am so proud of you, Simba. Well done. Well done, Baba! Well done! So earlier I removed the flower section because I wasn't too sure if he was scared of this so it worked both ways so it works without the flower and with the flower and I think Simba is more confident to start drinking from it so all it matters is that he has the understanding that safe to drink from it so hopefully he'll stop relying on going in the counter and waking us up early in the morning or during the night just to drink from the tap water so as you can see I have kind of blocked it because he has a habit of going inside and just waiting there until we come and find him but um yeah hopefully that will end and he can start drinking from his patted water fountain <laughs>